My name is Deborah Berevicius and I'm the Chief Data Scientist at Metis in New York. You don't need a specific background to be a data scientist. Anyone can do it, but you do need to be prepared. And here's my advice for how to do it. Tip number one, understand what you're signing up for when you join a data science bootcamp. If your goals are to get a job in industry, in a corporation, definitely a bootcamp is a great option. In an academic setting, it takes a lot longer. You may do a master's or, or take uh, you know, a college degree and that may take two to four years, whereas in a bootcamp, it's an intensive 12-week course and you emerge uh, with practical skills. On the technical aspect, you learn the basic tools of dealing with data web scraping, Git, GitHub, where do I look for data, how do I clean data, what are the typical data sources out there, etc. From then on, we move on to learning different algorithms that help data scientists gain insight into a particular business problem. So we learn linear regression, um, a singular value decomposition, uh, machine learning such as supervised learning, unsupervised learning, deep learning, big data, etc. All kinds of tools that help in different uh, data settings. Let me give you an everyday example of data science. We all use Facebook, right? And so as a data scientist, you would be concerned with what's behind Facebook's algorithms such as where, where do they place ads, how do they engage their communities, how do they optimize their news feeds, how do they create engagement with communities that uh, don't usually spend a lot of time on the site. These are all questions that the business needs and that you could use the toolkits of data science to solve. Tip number two is a little preparation goes a long way. The amount of preparation that you do before applying for a bootcamp goes a long way. It can mean the difference between drowning the first couple of weeks or being completely on top of the material. In terms of preparing for the bootcamp, I recommend that you have a college level understanding of linear algebra, probability, statistics, calculus, and Python. That does not mean that you have to have a college degree in those subjects. It does mean that you have to either learn it on your own, take an online course. I highly recommend Learn Python the Hard Way. It's a great resource for people who want to try and learn these topics themselves. In addition to the technical abilities that you should have to apply for a data science bootcamp, you should have curiosity and practical abilities. For example, in our application process, you have to be able to pull data and do a whole exploratory data analysis, and you should also be able to explain a project that you're interested in. Tip number three, embrace the data science attitude. The backgrounds of students that apply for a data science bootcamp are varied. We have people coming from uh, BAs in mathematics, economics, uh, but all the way to journalism, they've worked a few years in marketing, we've had people who have an English degree, others come from having worked in industry, say in banking or in healthcare or in, in you know, any other area, and they all are at a turning point where they want to change their careers and have a job as a data scientist. Being a good data scientist means that you can turn data into actionable insights for business. That means that you have successfully mastered three areas. Being able to use a computing language such as Python or R or any other. Being able to learn the math behind the algorithms in data science. And three, being able to communicate your insights to the stakeholders in a business. Even if you don't have a background in business, being able to communicate your ideas to other people without a mathematical background is super important. And it can mean the difference between a regular data science and a top of the line data scientist. Tip number four, set yourself up for success. In data science, we say there are three elements to succeed, curiosity, grit, and passion. 
you need to be a curious person because you need to pull data and tools from different fields and different areas to have a successful solution to a problem. You also need to have grit because it's not the kind of career where everything's going to work out from the get-go. You need to be able to get up and try again every time you feel like you're not getting at a solution. And finally, you need to have passion. If you're not passionate about discovering the world and answers to business problems, chances are you're not going to succeed as a data scientist. Let me be honest, a data science bootcamp is going to be hard. During 12 weeks, you're going to put in a lot of hours into mastering the materials. There's homeworks, there's, work, there's working with your teammates, uh, collaborating on projects, spare programming, challenges, projects, all of that. It requires creativity, hard work, and a good attitude. There are different challenges that, that can come up in the process of a bootcamp. If you embrace the three elements of curiosity, grit, and passion, you're way more likely to get over the initial challenge of doing a data science bootcamp. To summarize what you need before you sign up for a data science bootcamp is understand what you're signing up for, get yourself technically prepared, embrace the data science attitude, and set yourself up for success.